What's up guys, Nerdy Noob here, welcome to a, uh, another unboxing video. I guess it's not special edition because, uh, you know, it's it's a monthly subscription. This is a new box. New box alert, new box alert, new box alert. I haven't done that in a while. Guys, I'm really excited about this. This is our Shumi monthly box. I, I don't know if that's what it's actually called, but this is from the company Shumi Toys and Gifts but also Shumi Nation, and this is their new monthly subscription box. Basically what this is, it's kind of like Pop in the Box, sort of. Basically what this is, is that you go on there and you can pick, you can pick however many pops you want. So you can get one, two, three, four, five, or six pops, and then you can also pick how often you want them. So you can get six pops monthly, you can get six pops every week, every other week, every, I don't know what the options are to be honest, but they have that on there for you. Yeah. I wanted to try out this box. The cool thing about it is that they actually use this new feature they have on their website called the Shumi Tracker. So you go through and you pick the pops that you're interested in, you give it a thumbs up, and they're saying that they're guaranteeing that you'll get one of the pops that you put in your Shumi Tracker. And if it's not in stock or they don't have it, then they'll contact you. So you're basically guaranteed to get pops that you're interested in. Because this is a new box and technically it is a subscription box, I'm gonna go ahead and, and get some pricing details for you just so you guys have an idea. I'll also put them down below just so, you know, it's there. Now because obviously this box is really big because I picked the six pop option for monthly. That's what I picked and it's basically because the discounts as they got as you get more pops the discounts got better and better and so i just figured let's just get all six like let's not worry about it. the other thing they say is they have this kind of like i forgot what it's called like an exchange rate so if you got like two or three pops and you had like a deluxe pop or a pop rides or something they could potentially say instead of two pops you're gonna get a deluxe pop i don't know what the conversion thing is it's actually all in their website there's a lot of details you have to check it out and because i did subscribe to it where i'm gonna get it monthly i also saved another five percent so if you do they have a lot of different pricing but basically if you do one pop monthly it's going to cost you thirteen dollars or twelve thirty five if you get a subscription and that's including shipping that's the one thing i liked about it if you did that i don't even want to give you the pricing for like well the pricing is going to stay if you do it like every four weeks then it would just be that if you did it obviously weekly then each week you'd get charged that and then you'd get shipped a pop so thirteen dollars or twelve thirty five for one pop if you get two pops it's twenty four dollars which basically means twelve dollars a pop or twenty two eighty if you get the subscription so basically we went from thirteen to twelve if you get three pops then it equals thirty three dollars which is eleven dollars per pop or thirty one thirty five um total if you so it's thirty three dollars if you do a one time purchase thirty thirty one thirty five if you subscribe for four pops it's going to be forty dollars one time purchase thirty eight dollars for the subscription that's ten dollars a pop for five pops it's forty eight dollars for one time or forty five sixty for the subscription which equals for the one time it's nine dollars and sixty cents so instead of ten dollars it's nine dollars and sixty cents for the six pops it comes out to be fifty four dollars and that's nine dollars a pop or fifty one thirty if you get the subscription so right now i'm going off of the fifty one thirty price point because i got the subscription i did six pops monthly i'm not trying to get six pops every week that's kind of a lot of pops i also spent time and went through my shumi tracker and tried to pick all the pops that i wanted the one thing about it though if you do this is that whatever I get in here if I don't want it anymore I need to make sure I go on my Shumi tracker and delete them from there but it was very therapeutic for me to actually go on my Shumi tracker and like pick the pops that I wanted so I thought that was kind of cool all right fairly straightforward I'm getting each of these pops for nine dollars which is a really good price point I don't think that they let's see I picked some random pops you guys I'm kind of interested to see what's going to be in here because I picked some really interesting random pops. Again, everything is free shipping in the prices that I gave you. There's an exchange value. Basically two pops equal one six inch pop or two pack and three pops equal a pop ride or a movie moment. So there's your kind of exchange. And here's their promise with this box. Guaranteed mint condition, no duplicates, and they'll give you a pop that you have in your shimmy tracker. So I thought that was pretty cool, especially with some of the the boxes I've been getting lately like I like the mint condition guarantee and I think in the future they're actually planning on starting to put protectors on them but I don't know that for a fact so you have to stay tuned all right let's check it out and see what we got I'm very excited just to see this thing it is kind of pricey to be honest 
I mean, it's not pricey for what I'm getting, but I don't know if I need to be buying six pops monthly. So I might, I might drop that down a little bit later and get less pops a month because it just depends on how everything's going. Okay, wow. So once you cut the tape and you open the box, you have another box. There is an air shaver, saver, shaver, saver, and then they have another box in here with another pack of air on the bottom. So my Funko Pops are going to be in this box right here. This was a box that he obviously got with Tommy Lee Pops, but hopefully there's no Tommy Lee Pops because I don't think I have any Tommy Lee Pops in my Shumi Tracker. But we shall see. And i got to be very careful to not cut any of these Pops. Okay, good. I did it. All right. Oh, what is this? Uh, this is my re receipt thing, which is cool. How funny is this? Okay, so this is what it looks like. If you guys saw my video, my Toy Tokyo video, then you'll know that I actually got this pop and it was in terrible condition, but I did put all of the Monster Ink Pops on my Shumi Tracker because I really wanted the Boo and Sully and the Chef, and I figured I might as well get the whole collection. And then it looks like well, we got some other ones. So let's check out what we got. So the first pop that I'm going to show you, we're going to do our Raws. Now, again, I got this in my Toy Tokyo, but it was in terrible condition. So I'm excited that I got this one and it's in great condition. It's actually really nice. I'm very excited about that. And let's do it. So we're going to go, I mean, we're doing Monster Inc. So we got Chef, which I love this pop a lot. I love this pop a lot. I love it a lot. I love sushi too, which helps, but I love this pop a lot. So we got Chef. And then we got... Sully! Yes! Now there's been a couple Sully Pops. This one's a little bit derpy, but I like this one. And he's big, and his head's really big. He's got a really big head. But here is Sully, and this box also came in very good condition. Uh, there's a small, like, bend on the top, but I think I can fix that, actually, by just taking this out of the box and then, like, putting something flat on the box. So there's Sully. That's very cool. And then, of course, we got Boo! Boo is my favorite character from Monsters, Inc., so I'm so glad that I got this pop as well. It's very, very cool. And she's holding her little, like, monster teddy bear, which is neat as well. So now I officially have this entire set, which is very nice. I am excited about that. All right, next we got... Oh, look! It's so funny! I just made that comment about me not having the regular Jack-Jack. How funny is that? Isn't that hilarious, you guys? So we got regular Jack Jack. Now I don't have to worry about buying him, which is cool, because I've been trying to get all the different variants of him, but I actually don't have the regular one of him. So we got regular Jack Jack. He is quite small, If to be honest. Like, this is definitely not a pop that I would normally just buy a whole bunch of, because look how small he is. Like, you're definitely not getting your money's worth with this guy. He helps support when you have to buy, like, a Sully Pop. He's the guy that supports the material fees because Sully is like five times bigger than Jack-Jack. And then the last pop that we got is, we got the, um, the Vulp, Vulp text, Vulp text, Vulp text, I don't know how you say it, from The Last Jedi. Those are little dogs that, well, I, I mean, you probably would have seen The Last Jedi by now, right? But it's the little crystal foxes that come out at the end. Um, I didn't have this one, and I actually really enjoyed the way that this one looked. It wasn't, I have this whole set, but for some reason this one wasn't included in the original set. So it's not an exclusive or anything. It's just they came out with it afterwards, but I really wanted to add it, and I actually really enjoy this pop. I think it's very pretty. I am a fan. Okay, so there you have it. We got all of these pops. Now, if I was really trying to get my money's worth, the one of the things that you can do is when you're adding pops to your Shumi tracker, you could technically compare prices. Like, I'm sure on Amazon you might be able to get some of these for not $9, but maybe for $8. But the one thing that's good about this box is that it's guaranteed to come in good condition, which Amazon, you guys know Amazon. When you buy things on Amazon, you just don't know how they're going to come. Sometimes you have to buy, like, five of them on Amazon just to know that you might get one that's in good condition. So that's the one reason why you would you would kind of go to a box like this. I bought the six pop version because again it dropped my pops down to nine dollars a pop instead of thirteen dollars a pop if you just get one pop at a time. So that's a pretty good savings right there. Four dollars. You can't go wrong with that. Now I might eventually drop it back down to like the four 
pops whatever was like nine was it 960 well 960 was ten dollars was four pops so I might drop it to like the four or five um, pop subscription I'm not quite sure yet. we'll have to see but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go on my shimmy tracker I'm gonna make sure I take all of these off of it so I don't get these again and then I'll also add if they have any new pops that they released I'll also add those I'm not quite sure if they have or not to be honest. I that's the one thing we'll see how this goes um, I get a little bit overwhelmed when I have to keep track of things so we'll see how long it lasts but so far so good and I'm glad that I got these pops in great condition and I'm happy because these are pops that I wanted which is great you can't go wrong with pops that you wanted but yeah I will make sure I link all of the pricings and everything down below if you guys want to check it out if you guys are just into Funko Pops and you have trouble getting your hands on them or where you get them they're kind of expensive this might be a good option for you I don't know if they do international shipping so you'll have to check on that I'm sure if they do it's not free shipping that is the other thing I like about this is like I'm paying $9 a pop, that's it. There's no shipping cost or anything like that. So that's also nice. All right, guys, that's all I have for you in this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to click the like button below. If you want to see more unboxing videos, go to check out my channel. I have a whole bunch on there, and you should subscribe. Let me know down below what you guys thought about this box. Obviously, if you were to get this box yourself, you wouldn't necessarily get these pops. These ones are specific to me. Uh, that's one thing to keep in mind. You might be looking at it like, why would I want Monster Ink Pops? Well, I chose to get monster ink pops that's why so it just depends on what you like but let me know what your thoughts are down below and let me know if you've signed up for the shumi monthly box and if so what what did you get did you get one pop two pop three pop four pop five pops or six pops and then how often did you get did you get weekly every two weeks every three weeks or every four weeks let me know all of that fun stuff down below and remember if you subscribe to my channel and your subscriptions are blocked to such a private you will make it onto my thank you to subscribers page which is coming up shortly before we go we must do the video shout out today's video shout is going to go to lizzie 2227 lizzie 2227 you get the video shout thank you so much for watching commenting and supporting my channel i appreciate all of your support um your comment that you left on my pushing box caught my eye and thank you so much for watching that video and thank you so much for you it sounds like you you like when me and my sister film together I actually miss filming with my sister and we still have one pushing box that we need to film so um so I'm excited about that but Lizzie 2227 you get that video shout out shout out to you Lizzie 2227 shout out to you 2227 yeah I've, I didn't want to mess up the, the numbers of twos that I gave all right guys I hope you have a great day and I will see you guys next time bye